mother bird sleeps at home during the day. Barn owls are rarely seen, although they are found throughout most of the United States. They usually hunt their prey under cover of night. The barn owl has keen eyes. It can see mice or other prey at great distances. Our male red wings feeding together in Florida where they go for the winter. There's not a single female in this flock. The males arrive long before the females. return to the northern mosses where they raise their young. These flocks are a familiar sight during March and early April in most of the northern states and Canada. arrive two or three weeks later, each decides which territory or which male she wants for the summer. Females are easily distinguished from males by their strict looks and by their dull shoulders. When the males arrive on their nesting ground, the flocks scatter, and each male selects a small territory in the marsh. He drives the other males away and sings and displays his scarlet epaulet.
there's uh, one subject we haven't touched on yet, and it's one that you're supposed to be quite famous for. Uh, you wouldn't mean birds, would you? They help to keep our waters clean. And they follow ships for the food that the sailors or the passengers throw. the ones with the white heads and white tails. grown-up suit of clothes. The young ones are brown and mottled. They gather in groups and look each other over, and uh, one male drives off another. But finally, after having considered the matter duly, they begin to pair off. Uh, are you with me first, would you? I would mean Bert. You haven't had anything interesting to tell us about birds? providing food. A brood usually consists of three or four young.
feathers appear as it grows older, but the brightly colored feathers do not appear until the second year. The parent birds often bring rabbits or squirrels to the nest. But when food is scarce, they may attack other birds. A case of hawk eat hawk. The heron 
fishes in shallow reedy waters on lakes or rivers. After fishing in one place for a while, he may fly on to another favorite spot. The heron, the heron, the heron eats many fish. to another. He's watching for fish. He's watching for fish.
everything that moves in the water. And when a fish swims by, he strikes and seizes the fish with his bill. When, when, when he sees a fish come near the surface, he plunges like a blue streak.
congregate on certain isolated islands. This island alone, more than 6,000 come annually. of nature, it appears that a perfectly good goose was to wear a long beak, wanting a fishnet.
lift their heavy bodies from their perches, and after several rapid strokes of their wings, level off in an environment for the amphibians.
A great many birds and animals depend largely on their natural camouflage to hide them from their enemies. It's only by chance that we spot the bittern wading from the shallows to his hideout among the reeds. If you try to make friends with him, he's not likely to cooperate. He's very quick to take offense. That elastic neck can stretch to about 12 inches. All the better to spear at you. If very much aroused, he'll even try to peck your eyes out. feeds her family delicious morsels of dragonfly. The male stays on guard. <laughs> 